Hello, everybody. Can you hear me? Yes. Right. A very good evening to you all and a very, very warm welcome from the University of Surrey. It's great to see you here um, in real form. So I'm Greg Melly. I work to the university, uh, university's vice chancellor, Max Liu, who sends his warm wishes. Um, he can't make it here this evening. I do have another role. Um, and that is I'm the university's sponsor for the Blackwell Park project. So just declaring that. So when I sit down a little bit later, I shall be very much in listening mode because I think this is a really important lecture. Um, so, but on to this evening. So the university and Guildford Society have had a close relationship for many years and it's a very warm relationship. We regard the society as a bastion of good sense particularly around design quality uh, and what it takes to create and maintain a beautiful place. So I, I, I really do believe that the society uh, ought to be respected and we should be very grateful for their contribution to Guildford. It's always been independent, it's always been professional, um, and it's always been very, very committed. Um, there's one other thing about the society. I saw the website up there a little earlier on. I commend that website to you as well because it's really an interesting news source. So if you want to know anything about property, anything about development, anything that's happening in Guildford, it's actually a pretty good uh, uh, resource. Um, housing supply is a very hot topic and obviously fiercely debated in this area in particular. Some people say that if we need housing, it needs to be in the north, in tower blocks or somewhere else. And other people say... We need it here, we need it now, and they don't spend enough time talking about the infrastructure, talking about placemaking, talking about community building, uh, and talking about quality. The trouble with these two extremes is there's not the conversation about the quality, about the design quality, about what we need to achieve as a society in terms of placemaking, in terms of community building, and so on. So that's why I think this is a fantastic opportunity tonight. So we've got two wonderful architecture practices here. We've got James, Jason Cornish from Field and Clegg Bradley, who's going to be talking next. And we've got Glenn Howells from Glenn Howells Architects. So I'm very much looking forward to those conversations a bit later. At about quarter to eight, um, Peter Coleman will be taking the mic and be opening it up for questions. Um, so that will be your, uh, your opportunity to ask questions a bit later. So thank you. That's about all I wanted to say. Other